Hello and thank you for joining me today. It's Rambling Rachel with The Hiking Viking and we are exploring National Trust Stow Gardens in Buckinghamshire. Sarah's making friends already. There is Stowe House in the background. There's lots of swans and geese and various different other creatures. We're currently just positioned by the Eastern Pavilion. It's very nice. In the lovely grounds of Stowe. You just miss the swans fighting. <laughs> I don't think they're too happy with each other. We are now at the Temple of Friendship, which looks like it's seen better days if I'm honest. It's a bit of a ruin, um, but it's quite nice to, to walk around. There isn't a huge amount of information about it as such. Let's have a little look around the back. As you can see, there's no windows in it anymore. Yeah, good, interesting, something I've never seen before. Hannah's bimbling about behind me. I don't know where she's going. I can't believe I've lived in Northamptonshire all my life and this has been on my doorstep and I've never actually visited Stowe Gardens before. Um, I've only been here about 10, 15 minutes and uh, yeah, it's been a real interesting walk so far. And here we have one of the beautiful bridges of Stowe. Maybe a little bit overstated, but yeah, it's not something you see every day. And some nice views of the river. There's quite a lot of people here actually. It's nice. We are heading towards the next temple. And we're now at another temple. If you look closely, you can probably see the Greek goddesses and gods and all that business. What we've got down here, that's what it's called. Lovely. Every corner we turn, there appears to be something new and interesting to see. So this is what we've just discovered. I'm not sure what that's called, but I'm sure we'll find out soon. This uh, statue. More exploring, more discovering. Very exciting. Even if you're not a National Trust member, it is probably worth the entrance fee because this really is a fascinating place to go. Some really interesting stuff to see. For a moment there, I thought we'd uh, uncovered some weeping angels. There you go, Doctor Who reference for the geeks out there. <laughs> Here is another view of Stone Manor from the distance. They've got a lacrosse field there. There were some children playing lacrosse on that earlier. Oh, look at those 
autumn colours through the trees. Splendid. As we come round, you can actually see the entrance. It does look a bit like a mini Arc de Triomphe actually. And then we have, as I call them, the Weeping Angels just through the arch where we've just come from. Here we have the Temple of British Worthies, that's technically what it's called, with all these various different busts. William Shakespeare, uh, that one, apparently. We've got Queen Elizabeth I, just there. Sir Francis Drake, Sir Walter Raleigh, King Alfred, Edward Prince of Wales. Yep, there you go history for you. Here we have the Venus Sun Trap. Obviously it's quite late in the afternoon and the sun is starting to go down and it's almost dusk. The sun is touching the horizon ever so slightly now. Looks like we've got some more Greek themed busts. Take some photos of them. Swan's just walked out of a bush, never seen that before. Aren't they majestic birds? It's probably thinking, why are you silly person filming me? Got a good waddle on. Keep waddling. We've finished our loop of Stowe Gardens. We've seen the busts and monuments and statues. A lot more to see than what we originally thought. It's a great place to visit. Definitely one of Northamptonshire's uh, beauty spots. Family friendly, mostly accessible. Highly recommend it. What would you say, Sana? The hiking Viking gives it a thumbs up. I'm just going to try and get some views of the sun going down in the background. That field was covered in sheep earlier, but there's not so many now. But the scenery around here absolutely breathtaking. We've left the main Stowe Gardens but we should be back at the car park very shortly. It's all looking a bit misty and all a little bit magical. Well thank you for joining me. Um, do come out and explore this wonderful place. Thanks. <laughs>